This is a force follow video. All force follow videos are in the public domain. Feel free to link it, embed it, download it, or share it with your friends. In this video we're going to talk about a drill to help you develop your feel for inside English. Keith McCready, perhaps the greatest bar table player of all time, was once asked uh, what gave him the competitive advantage over so many other players and Keith's response was his understanding and his ability to execute shots using inside English. So that's what we're going to talk about today in this video. The idea of this drill is to set up your object balls one diamond away uh, from the corner pocket one at a time and you place the cue ball accordingly uh, to the position of the object ball that you're shooting at and you want to use your inside English to go one rail and then back down for the ball uh, that's on the short rail. And that ball that's on the short rail is your target ball. That's where you want the cue ball to end up. Now inside English from my perspective here is right English. Another way of describing it is three o'clock on a clock face. Now for each of these shots I'm not really using a lot of power but what I am doing is ensuring a smooth uh, acceleration through the cue ball and that's going to give me the spin that I need to get back down for my target ball there on the short rail. Now you really want to ensure that you have a lot of chalk on your tip. Very important. You want to make sure your tip is groomed and you want to try to be as level as possible because squirt and swerve uh, can be an issue um, trying to execute this drill which is going to be the topic of a completely different video. So take this to the table. This is an important shot to have. It's really going to open up uh, your position play and your pattern play and where you want to put the cue ball. There are still numerous forms of pediatric cancer that medical science has not developed an effective treatment for. So that's why I'm leaving a link in the sidebar so you can get over to St. Jude's website and see what they do and leave some kind of donation. Really no donation is too small for a cause like this. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has benefited you in some way. Tell your friends about it and until next time have fun playing pool.